to him who much is given, much is required. And I grew up in a family that was always giving. We gave to our churches. We were always a part of some organization or something. My grandparents, I was raised by my grandparents. And my uh, grandfather was in his lodges, and he was always raising money for different causes. And he'd come around with these little things called gleaners, and you had to put dimes in them. And he would say, take this and see how much money you can raise. He said, because, you know, we, we help kids have uh, operations and surgeries and stuff through the Scottish Rites organization. So I grew up giving, and in church we're always taught, that, you know, that that's a reasonable portion of service just for being alive is each one help one. So by the time Sam and I were able to always pay our rent, which thank God we'd always be able to do, I said, you know, some of this we need to portion to the side for all these organizations we end up helping and sort of build money on the foundation to help with the different causes that we see, not just in our communities, but in communities around the world uh, for education and for um, health concerns because somehow we always end up with doing less for ourselves when it comes to our health. And that's the first thing that we should do is try to do more for ourselves whether or not it's the diets and nutrition, <laughs> excuse me, and helping our kids so that, because we have a disproportionate, and when I say this, I, I mean, middle class people have a disproportionate amount of asthma and, and small diseases with children, you know what I mean? And some of that I think nutritionally can be circumvented. So, you know, sometimes it only takes a little. And I know that when the little is put together, we have a lot. So that's what we try to do with, with our uh, foundation. We raise money for Alzheimer's. You know, we, we raise money for uh, children with diabetes from Children's Defense Fund um, with Marion Wright Edelman, who founded the Children's Defense Fund, uh, was a mentor of mine at Spelman. We both went to Spelman. She went ahead of me. And Hillary Clinton, our next president, uh, was part of that organization founding as well so I you know it, it's just something that we do and Marion always says is that giving and serving is the rent we pay for living and it's, it's something to think about because we that. should pay that rent